So what is up? I uh, I'm about to uh, I'll show you guys my exhaust that I welded up today. Um, it's actually pretty cool. It's uh, pretty pretty funny idea actually. So I took the flange. This is the whole thing. I took the flange off the old exhaust right there, and I put this pipe in here that was bent already. And then I welded up, let's see, I welded up this old exhaust off of a old Briggs and Stratton, right? And what I'm doing now currently, I'll show you really quick. My, uh, my tripod broke, so I gotta do it. So this beer can, it slides on this exhaust so it slides on to like right right here ish um and what i'm gonna do right now is i'm gonna take this exhaust wrap and i'm gonna soak it really quick in some water and then i'm gonna wrap this whole pipe all around so i'll try to get a video of me doing that too so the reason why you gotta let it soak is so that all the bubbles come out Okay, so you soak the you soak the exhaust wrap, and then you're able to get more tension around the pipe, and then you'll take something like this, which is basically just a metal zip tie, and you'll just zip tie it on either both ends or one end, and tuck one under. But uh, yeah, you this is a a must do in the process of exhaust wrapping. I've wrapped like three or four exhausts, actually no three, uh, only two, only two. <laughs> I uh, exhaust. I did my motorcycle exhaust uh, about a year and a half ago, and uh, I did a dune buggy exhaust. And you have to wear gloves too, because you will get fiberglass splinters in your hands, and they fucking hurt. Like especially when you get them like right in between the webbing of your hand and shit. It's fucking horrible. 